Middle schoolers in the area are building robots out of Legos. Teams competed today in various tasks to show their design and programming skills. Local News 8's Hannah Miller shows us what they did. And then it goes forward again for one rotation. For some, Legos build houses. For these students, they build robots. This is not our actual original robot. We had to take apart our other one because it was too wide to take some of the corners. So we uh, had to build this one. But so basically, we wanted to do this one because uh, its design is how we could get the most points possible as quickly as possible. The robots are pre-programmed to do a number of tasks on an obstacle course to gain points, like pushing a truck or dropping items in certain places. They're also judged on design and sportsmanship. So if they kind of do very well with each other, kind of give high fives to the other teams saying good job, we make that a huge deal for all these things because that's more important. Judges say the competition provides a higher level of mathematic and engineering training. Because that's kind of a good thing for younger kids to start learning because that's kind of what's going on in the world. It's a big deal now. Aside from the robot competition, students must make a project solving a problem they see in the world today. Case and Summers use a 3D printer to create a model of a moving composter, a spin-off the normal garbage truck. His model can remove metals from waste, compact, and even burn garbage while decreasing pollution. This would help uh, reduce all that trash in those landfills and make a cleaner world for us to live in so that people aren't walking on trash and are, aren't like doing harmful things to the environment. In Idaho Falls, I'm Hannah Miller. The students competed in three rounds of competition. Those three scores are average to determine a winner.